If you've got your microeconomics final exam coming up, this is why your professor keeps saying that monopolies cause dead weight loss. All right, so here's an example monopoly market right here. And these are the three curves we need to pay attention to. The marginal cost curve for a monopoly serves as the supply curve. Because remember, they're the only firm producing in the markets, so there's really no supply curve. If this monopoly were being socially optimal, they'd produce right here at this price and this quantity. This is the socially optimal point of production because it's the intersection point between the demand curve and the supply curve for monopolies, marginal cost. But remember, all firms produce where MR equals MC. MR, MC. And that point occurs right here. Actually, we'll use red right here to distinguish which corresponds to this quantity, we'll call that Q2. But remember, price is not that right there. Actually, we gotta go up to the demand curve and see where we intersect at that point because the demand curve represents consumers' willingness to pay at a given quantity. Now, from here, we can see the dead weight loss triangle right here. And this is caused by that reduction in quantity from the socially optimal point by the monopoly, producing at their profit maximizing point of MR equals MC. All right, if you like the way I explain microeconomics and are in desperate need of some help for your final, go check out my website. I've got my microeconomics cram kit where I can walk you through all the concepts in this class in around two hours. Free access to you available whenever you need it. It's basically like having me as your tutor the night before your exam.